Autonomic dysreflexia is um, perhaps one of the most severe, potentially dangerous and fatal conditions that can occur um, in individuals with spinal cord injury and particularly happens to individuals um, who are injured at a level at what we call T5, which is mid-chest and higher. Um, and what happens with this condition is that a patient's blood pressure can rise very quickly and very high uh, to the point where they can actually have a seizure or a stroke or even die. Um, what happens or what causes the autonomic dysreflexia is, is usually some kind of stimulus that's um, irritating to the body. Um, and so this could be anything from having an overly full bladder, uh, being really constipated, um, having a sunburn, having an ingrown toenail, having a fracture, anything like that. Um, what happens in spinal cord injury patients is that there's a disconnection between their body um, and their brain. Um, and so what happens is, is when you have an irritating stimulus, it sets off this reflex in the body to contract the blood vessels. Um, and by contracting the blood vessels, the pressure shoots up really high. Um, and so this can be a really emergency situation. Um, and for Brad, it's particularly dangerous because if he's out in the middle of nowhere, um, rock climbing or climbing a mountain, um, if this happens, if he gets a sunburn, if he um, hurts himself somehow, um, his blood pressure can rise very quickly. And if he can't access a hospital or emergency medical care, um, I mean, this potentially could give him a seizure stroke or even kill him.